general cleaning and maintenance on the ELBV. Any dirt, dust, mud can be allowed to dry and can be brushed out with a stiff nylon brush. That would generally get most of that sort of mud and dirt out of your pouches and out of the garment itself. If the ELBV requires greater cleaning, then a couple of simple ways to do that. It can be either dry cleaned or you can wash it in a, a commercial, your own home washing machine on gentle machine cycle with a good high quality liquid soap. But most importantly, two things to remember. First, the PFD has to be removed. Do not leave the PFD whilst washing the vest. And also ensure all items of accoutrement are removed from the pouches. That includes also any infringement notebooks which you may have located in the pockets. Once all of those items are removed, just re-engage the flaps, press studs, and re-engage the vest, doing it up. With the PFD removed, this can now be placed into a standard washing machine at home, gentle machine cycle. Fixtures and fittings, maintenance of those. The press studs are a stainless steel, marine grade press stud. But like all items, they do require maintenance. So in the first instance, on issuing your vest, I would recommend a, a silicon spray or a dry glide lubricant spray. And these can be applied into the heads and the bodies of the actual press studs. We also have internally, we have the zippers here for the pockets. And I would recommend, again, just a light coat of the silicon spray. Internal zippers, there's the rear zipper. Again, a dry glide or silicon spray to the head of the zipper and or the body of the zipper. On the inside of the vest itself, there is a zipper system here on the right hand side, the right hand wing of the vest. And this is a zipper which can be used later on for any protective panels to be fitted. Dry lube, this point here and the lower point inside the zipper. The vests have been supplied with the, the, the other half of the zipper. That can be removed, unzipped, and stored in your kit bag. General cleaning. Obviously, you're engaged in a lot of salt water activity, and the vest itself may suffer some salt water immersions or spray. So a very simple and easy task to perform after a day or so at sea is to take your ELVV, lay it out on a flat bench, the internal fabrics of the garment are such that they're fast dripping and drying, and these will ultimately absorb perspiration, and that perspiration will remain as salts inside this garment here, and that will be ultimately what will make you smell. So, commercial kitchen foam sponge or car washing sponge, basically. Fresh water, just wring the water out and just press this through the 3D channel mesh. Constant rinsing and that will transfer the salts from the vest into the uh, bucket of water. Then paying consideration to these areas underneath the arms where you will get a build up of perspiration. Doesn't have to be saturated, just needs to be dampened down and just constantly cleaned through the bucket of water. The vest can then be reassembled and hung up to dry and air.